This is the famous Star Wars toy BB-8, and right now it's being controlled by the Force. Okay, not entirely true, but it's responding to thoughts. Baffled? Here's how it works. Emotive have been making headsets for a little while, and last year they put a Kickstarter out for what's essentially a consumer brain reader, and it uses EEG. We can understand EEG and sort of like train that and run some algorithms, and in this instance we're, we're pushing off a, a command of pushing and pulling the, using the force to push and pull BB-8. The good news is it can open a world of opportunities in things from consumer tech to healthcare. Having a, a brain reader is really cool, but it, it only becomes useful when we can do some, something meaningful at the end of it. For me, meaningful is moving the BB-8, but meaningful for somebody who has lost the use of their limbs, moving a wheelchair is meaningful for them. And you don't have to spend an obscene amount of your tech whiz to do that. The EEGs have been around for quite a long time, but this is probably the first time that we've seen it used in a almost commercial product, you know, a consumer product. It's only $300-ish, so. It would be really easy for anyone who is developer inclined to recreate what I've done here using IBM's Bluemix. So I did this in my spare time. Um, I was just playing about with uh, Bluemix, and it was uh, a couple of late evenings, maybe, but um, definitely only two evenings. 